Hi, I'm Brandon. Welcome to TRA Snow and Sun. We are solving problems related to rooftop avalanches through our snow retention system. Today, we are going to talk about how to install our products, so let's get right to it. Hello, Ben Anderson here with TRA Snow and Sun. Today, we're going to be installing a snow blocker 2 on some asphalt shingles. Tools you'll be needing, a drill with a 3 8 inch socket and a 7 16 inch socket, a four millimeter Allen, a chalk line, a tape measure, and a grinder with a cutting disc or a hacksaw. Let's get started. Grab your snow blocker with your drill with your 3 8 inch socket. The snow blocker is very versatile. It can go into trusses or rafters. It can go into purlins, and it can also go into sheathing. Today we're using sheathing with the number 14 screws. Find your location, line up with your chalk line for your pipe later. For optimal strength, please use three screws at the top and one screw at the bottom. Proceed with installing your pipe. In the middle of fields, just continue all the way through, continuing to feed at termination spots. You will need two end caps and two collars. Collars go on the inside of the last snow blocker. Grab your Allen and tighten to 15 foot pounds. Install your end caps. And for those who have purchased ice flags to mitigate ice underneath the pipes, install with the longer edge uphill and your bolt and nut with your bolt on the downhill side. Grab your drill with your 7 16 inch socket and also tighten to 15 foot pounds. That concludes the install of a snow blocker 2 on asphalt shingles. If you have any questions, please consult TRA's engineered layout. Thank you. You just learned how to install one of our many snow retention systems. We offer engineered snow retention layouts and quotes. For questions regarding your project, contact us at 800-606-8980 for sales at trasnowandsun.com. And we'll take care of the rest. Thank you for joining us.